your Google Classroom under Literacy Resources, you will see this as a checklist. This is your writing checklist. So anytime you are finished writing, you want to look at this and see, is your piece a first grade piece? So we look at structure, which is how something is organized. We look at the development, what's inside your writing. And then language conventions, which would be spelling and punctuation and capitalization. So those are the three things we're looking at. So I'm right now looking at my piece that I wrote yesterday, and I'm going to see if I wrote a first grade piece. So the first one says lead. I tried to make a beginning for my story, and it should be something like one hot sunny day I went to play soccer. So that's what we have here as an example. I don't have that in my story. I just start off with first. So I'm going to have to say, no, not yet. Now, I will tell you that in um, Google Classroom, I don't think that you'll be able to play with this like I am, like how I'm able to check the check boxes. So um, what I would do if I were you is I would print this um, and then do it. So I need to put that in. The next one is transitions. I have transitions. I say first, I say next, I say last. So I'm gonna say yes. Then it says, I found a way to end my story. And here's an example. We won, I felt so proud. So when we're ending a story, we tell someone how, if we liked it or not, or how we felt. And when I'm looking at my last page, I don't have an ending. So I'm gonna just say, not yet. Then it says I wrote my story across three or more pages, and I do because I have my first page, my second page, and my third page. So I did that. And then it says I put the picture from my mind onto the page. I had details in pictures and words. So making sure that um, we have all of our pictures colored, we um, are telling the reader what happened. So I'm gonna say, yes, I did that. I use labels and words to give details. I don't have any labels, but I do have words. So I'm gonna say, starting to, because that's kind of in the middle. When I look down here for spelling, it says I used all I knew about words and chunks to help me spell. Yes. I spelled all the word wall words right and used the word wall to help me spell other words. Yes. I ended with punctuation. I capitalized names and it says I used commas and dates and lists. Well, I didn't have, oh, I did use commas actually with my transitions. So I can say yes. So when I'm looking at this checklist, anything that is not yet or starting to, I want to go back and I want to fix those. So today, what I want you to do is I want you to use this checklist to go over the writing piece you did yesterday to see if you did it like a first grader.